Should I say that I have four kids and that I have no time and that what? Yeah, let me do that one. Personally, I pictured myself like up on a hill, like overlooking San Francisco with the wind blowing in my hair. <laughs> My name is Alicia Fox. I'm a director at India Hicks. I've got four kids, a husband, two big fat hairy dogs, and my life is pretty crazy. I'm Kelly McElveen, looking for something different in my life to get me out of the house surrounded by all the boys. And my dear friend Alicia introduced me to India Hicks. Hi, I'm Ruby. And I'm her mom, Samantha Hollinshead from Dallas, Texas. I'm a director with India Hicks. I'm Melissa, and I'm a director at India Hicks. Can I make up where I'm from? I'm Emily Chapman from Oyster Bay, New York. I'm Kitty Bell and I'm from Chapel Hill, North Carolina. I've been blessed enough to live in Manhattan and London and Paris. I'm from the marketing world and I worked in corporate America. And after my children got older, I was looking for an opportunity where I could get back into the business world. So I went to work for a startup in the city. It was for very little money and it was a lot of time. I have a junior in high school now. And what I found was that when I got into the workforce with the younger people and the man that was running the business is they wanted a total commitment of 24 seven. I really needed an opportunity in my life where I could run something on my own. I had an extremely successful accessories business where I was manufacturing, designing, producing, and selling to the top department stores. By the time I had my third child, I decided I'm not going to do this anymore. I'm going to just focus on them. And that was the most rewarding thing I've ever done in my life. But there comes a time now when I do have time to do things that are fulfilling for me as well as for my family. I was a salesperson in my past life. So joining India Hicks kind of reignited that old sales mojo. You get to a certain age and you want what you want and you don't want to do any bullshit. I can work at my own pace. I can make it what I want to make it. It's a, it's a lot easier than fundraising because you don't actually ask them for money. They get something when they leave. You're not doing the selling. You introduce the people to the products and then they sell. I really connected with the message that India puts out about living an extraordinary life. I think what it comes down to when you're living an extraordinary life, it's about how you feel from the inside. Did you feel it? Did you feel it? Did you get chills? It's very hard to do things completely on your own. And I think that's what the company's based on is this great tribe, this great teamwork. I really checked everybody out before I signed on and I love it. Top management is amazing and I think the people are committed to the business. They're asking me for a $400 investment. That was definitely a chance I was willing to take. And the most wonderful part about this business has been reconnecting with friends and not just through Facebook, but one-on-one -on -one and over the phone. Now that my team has grown and these women are so incredible and then we attract more incredible women, that is what is really rewarding. Even though I'm at home and still the stay-at-home mom, I feel like I'm building my own business from inside my home and that feels really good. It's been so much fun, it's been so much fun and I really love my career at India Hicks.